We, we believe that for economic of China to run faster, to pursue nuclear energy is a key. We see that it used lesser area to not affect that much the environment, or even if it still um, gave off some um, radiation, we see that it's still like, um, it will be gone in just one month. And we see that it can, we can save we can save 700 million US dollar every year that we have to spend to importing um, energy from other countries. So uh, that we have to pay for full from other countries and we can save those money to develop more in our countries. Therefore, we see that nuclear energy is the main platform in the context of Thailand development, ladies and gentlemen. So before I move on to my clash, I would like to um, make some rebuttals. The first one is that you say the Thai people, Thai people don't have that, don't know about new um, thorium. They don't have the knowledge of this thorium. But um, Mr. Chair, we see that we see that just a producer or the um, the people that gonna pursue nuclear energy that. And he is the only person. The only person that needs to know what is thorium is, Mr. Chair, because not every person in Thailand needs to know, right? Because it is just a producer. The second rebuttal is that um, no, nuclear. They say that nuclear energy costs like um, more money to pursue. But however, Mr. Chair, we see that nowadays we have to spend like. Um, 700 million US dollar every year to for fuel for coal for energy that we have to importing from other countries with a share. The third thing is that they said about um, the accident of nuclear energy. We see that they are not listening, listening to our DPM speech at all because um, our DPM has already proven to you that nuclear energy has no explosion with a share. The fourth thing is that they say that um, nowadays we import. Um, Energy will be import full just 1.4 percent. Mr. Chair, we agree to this. We totally agree to this. We, this is why we see that we keep repeating that it is expensive. They say that we importing just 1.4 percent. But what we see is that we just 1.4 percent. We still have to spend 700 million US dollar, Mr. Chair. This is why we keep saying that we keep repeating that it is expensive, Mr. Chair. The last thing is that. They say that the impact of nuclear energy, they say that it give off radi radiation and it um, uh, like affect to the environment. However, M Mr. Chair, our DPM has already proven to you again, Mr. Chair. We see that nuclear energy, um, it, um, um, it gives out some radiation, but we see that it only takes about one month and it will be gone forever, even though we keep like producing it. And compared to Compared to them, it like um, give off like <coughs> methane gases, which stay like um, more than one thousand years every year, Mr. Chair. So let's begin with my clash. No, um, yes. What's your source? Okay, sir, you can search like go 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 to the Google and like <laughs> your clear energy or like um, all that we have to spend every year. You can search in uh, in uh, from the internet now. If, if you want to share. So let's begin with my first clash, which is who actually solve the economic problems that we are facing nowadays in Thailand. The first level is on the economically level. We see, as, I, as we have already proven to you that nuclear energy gives out energy, gives out more energy for, uh, that, that it can support for all people in Thailand. We see that it provides enough energy to support extremely large industry that can happen in Thailand because we have to um, like join asset company in two in three years. And we see that nuclear energy can cost like with cheaper cost and it and increase increased efficiency of the products that we can produce. And we see that this in this nuclear energy can support us if we join the asset community in three years. And because we see that in the ASEAN community we can have like high highly competitions in the ASEAN community, we see that it can reduce cost and we can gain more money because of the cheaper cost we share. The second level is on the environmental level. We see that um, nuclear energy is like zero, zero CO2 emission, which is it do not release CO2 at all, even if it, um, it still releases um, some radiation. But I've, as I've already told you that it just like take only one month and it will be gone. So we see that it is not affecting to the environment. So, and compared to the dam, a dam is like a 
actually create, um, it, not cre it, it is not creating like CO2 gases, but it's creating a gas that is even worse than, um, even worse than, CO than CO2, which is methane gases. And we see that it, it is even worse in the environment because it takes like 1,000 years stay in, in our Earth, and it, it is more than 1,000 years with a chair. And the lifetime is even longer to the CO2 gases. And we see that them need like more and more area to just build just one dam. It needs three mountains to build. So we see that it is like it is not fair. It it is like need like extremely much area to build just one dam. And it is not enough for our people in Thailand. Mm -hmm. And we see that the second thing is that it is like affecting a lot to the environment because it can create an earthquake because of like um, too much pressure that can happen because of them. The third level is that we see that nuclear energy that we're gonna pursue can bring a positive step in our country development because we see that first, nuclear energy use lesser area. It is cheaper and it is do not affect to the environment compared to the to share. It needs three mountains to create. Nowadays, we pay over one, um, 700 million US dollars per year to, um, to, like, to importing energy from other countries. And we see that it is, harm, it, it, it is harming to the environment and it can create earth, earthquakes. Therefore, we see that we can save those 700 million US dollars every year to develop more in our countries. And we see that, um, we see that there's three issues that they, of opposition I didn't tackle. The first one is that they say that they're gonna use coal and coal forever. However, how, how what is our question is that what if the what if it run out in one day? What they're gonna use, Mr. Chair? The second thing is that the they say that the government don't the, um don't have that much budget to pursue nuclear energy. However, they, they nowadays they, they spend like seven hundred million US dollars US dollars to pursue um, energy from other countries. The third thing is that do we need to de depend on other countries for everlasting with the share? We have to spend money to importing um, energy from our from other countries every year. So at the end of the day, we see that we have tackled off their points and the government gave study song at the end of the day and we are very proud to propose. Thank you.